But as I started to think about what I wanted to, to say about Brian tonight, um, I realized that this speech isn't really directed at Brian. He knows how I feel about him. And in fact, you know, there's a lot of wonderful people gathered here tonight for Brian and Crystal, but this speech isn't really directed at you guys either. When I really thought about it, actually, I think the best man speech is really directed at Crystal. You know, this is my one last chance to tell you how great of a decision I think you've made about Brian. Crystal, it has been almost three years now since we first met, and I could have never imagined how much my life would change after meeting you. Your presence and love has made me a better person all around. I had no idea how empty a man's life could be without a wonderful woman at his side. To my husband on our wedding day, Brian, where do I begin? I feel like the luckiest woman in the world to have met you. You are everything I could have ever asked for and more. You are the man I want to grow old with. You are the person I want to have my children with. I love you so much. I am so excited for our future together. Love, Mrs. Rapp. So, as I raise my glass, I wish the best to your marriage and to your life together and to the lives that you will have in the future. invite you into the sanctuary along with your wedding party so that we can now exchange your vows and your rings.